Peter J. Chilkovsky, Professor of Middle Eastern Studies, New York University, writes, Hussein accepted and set out from Mecca with his family and an entourage of about 70 followers. But on the plain of Karbala, they were caught in an ambush set by Yazid. Though defeat was certain, Hussein refused to pay homage to him. Surrounded by a great enemy force, Hussein and his company existed without water for 10 days in the burning desert of Karbala. Finally, Hussein, the adults and some male children of his family and his companion were cut to the bits by the arrows and swords of Yazid's army. His women and remaining children were taken as captives to the Yazid in Damascus. The renowned historian Abu Rayhan stated, the fire was set to their camp and the bodies were trampled by the hooves of the horses. Nobody in the history of humankind has been such atrocities.